Moves forward with opening the economy, Governor Greg Abbott has put together a special task force to get guidance on the safest ways to move forward. The only El Pasoan on that task force is Rick Francis, chairman of the board for West Star Bank. Our very own Patricia Maese sat down with him for a special interview. And joining me now is a chairman for West Star Bank, but also one of the El Pasoans who was selected to sit on the task force here in Texas to help reopen the economy. Rick Francis joining us now. Thank you for being here on the newscast. Now, tell us as you work with other Texans to help reopen the economy, how do you balance both the safety of people who are really concerned about the virus, but also those who are concerned about the economy? Well, I would tell you that... First and foremost, it has been an honor that I was selected by the governor to represent El Paso, and I take that very seriously. First and foremost, the safety of our citizens is of the utmost importance. With that said, we also understand that Texans need to go back to work. Mm -hmm. Our local community depends on people being able to earn a living, and so uh, the governor has asked a group of us to make recommendations to him uh, as to how we can gradually begin to reopen the state. And Rick, let me ask you, you're a businessman and we know that at the heart of El Paso or small, at the heart of El Paso and Texas are small businesses. They really are what keep this economy thriving. Many people are worried about the economy more so than the virus. Would you agree that there's a, a measured way to do both, to keep people safe but also get the economy going? Well, certainly I've heard that and I've spoken to both our mayor and county judge and a lot of business owners as well as medical professionals that, uh, and, and again, there's a, there's a tale of two, you know, two groups. One wants to err uh, on, on, with caution. Others want to charge ahead. With the governor's leadership and with our local, our mayor and our county judge, uh, I hope we'll strike a balance that will, again, protect the lives of our citizens. And at the same time, though, with using safe measures such as uh, social distancing, masks, and the things that are necessary to ensure that as we begin to open up our economy, uh, that we will be as safe as possible. All right, Rick Francis, thank you so much for being here with us on our newscast. Thank you so much. And of course, we wish you the best as you work to represent El Pasoans and Texas in helping to reopen the economy. Thank you so much. Well, if you've been spending